Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about iPhones and Androids. And more specifically, I'm gonna show you how to transfer your phone contacts from your iPhone to your Android device. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is gonna be a really quick video. There's not a lot of steps involved, actually a really easy process. And there's a few things you're gonna need in order for this to work. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video guys. Not gonna be a long one. So first off, why would you wanna transfer your contacts from your iPhone to your Android device? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe you switch devices and you're no longer using your iPhone, you're gonna be using your Android device. And the thing is, iPhone doesn't really make it too easy to easily export your information from your iPhone to an Android. So you will need to have an iCloud account, which you probably already have. You'll also need a web browser. You cannot do this on a mobile device. It must be a laptop, a desktop, your iMac or MacBook, because that is the only way that you can share your contacts through a browser. A mobile browser would be blocked. So let's go ahead and get this started. So first off, you want to go to your iPhone and then go to the settings, which is this gear icon icon right here, this gray wheel. I'm going to click there now. All right, I went ahead and opened up my settings and then this drop down menu happens. Let me move this Android device out of the way. So here on the iPhone settings, you want to click on your username or your name at, here at the top. It's also going to have your profile icon or picture. It doesn't really matter. I'm going to click there now. All right next, your Apple ID menu is going to pop up. And what you want to do is go ahead and click on iCloud right here. It's the one with the blue and white icon. I'm going to click there now. All right, so now we are looking at the drop down menu for your iCloud. So this is a pretty important step. You want to make sure that your contacts are shared in your iCloud and you just make sure this toggle is green like mine is. If it's not, be sure to just just toggle it over and then it just gives you the option to go ahead and save it into your iCloud. So once that's done, it's going to be green and then we're ready to go. So I'm going to switch over to my web browser now. Okay guys, I went ahead and switched over to my MacBook now. Once again, it does need to be a desktop browser. And what you're going to want to do is go to iCloud.com. Be sure to check my video description. I'll try to leave a quick link there, but I'm going to go there now. All right guys, I went ahead and switched over to my iCloud right here, as you can see, and you're going to see all the different apps. Once again, if you went to iCloud.com on your mobile browser, you're only going to see a few apps inside your iCloud. It will not include your contacts. That's why That's why we need to go to the desktop. So here we are on the desktop. I'm going to click on contacts, which is this great app right here with like a little person looking thing on it. I'm going to click there now. All right, guys, I went ahead and clicked on my contacts. And here on this side, you're going to see all your different contacts that you have inside of your iCloud. But where you want to look is right over here. There's a little gear icon. It's on the bottom left right here. I'm going to click there now. All right, next, you can get this drop down menu. And what you want to choose is select all. And that way it chooses all of your contacts that are in your iCloud from your iPhone. I'm going to click there now. All right, next, all of your contacts will be highlighted in blue. And what you want to do is go ahead and click back here on this little gear icon. I'm going to click there now. All right, once you click there, that same drop down menu is going to happen. You're going to click export V card. I'm going to click there now. Okay, what should have happened is you should have downloaded that file that includes all your contacts. Now go to where your downloads are. I'm going to open that file now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened up my downloads. And as you can see right here is my iPhone contacts. Now with this file, what you can do is just easily email it to yourself. So whatever email you client you use, whether it's Gmail or your Mac mail, it doesn't really matter. You want to go ahead and email it to yourself. So I'm going to go ahead and email this to myself right now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened up my email client right here. And then I dragged the iPhone contacts into the email. I'm going to go ahead and send it out now. Okay, I went ahead and emailed out my complete iPhone contacts list. And we're moving on to the last step. You just want to go ahead and log into your email on your Android phone. So let me switch over to my Android phone now. Okay, so I went ahead and switched over to my Android device. And this is the one that's going to take all my contacts from my iPhone. Phone. And what you want to do is go ahead and just open up your email client. So I'm going to open up my Gmail. All right. So here's my Gmail right here. I'm going to click on there now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened up my email. And then as you can see, the email is right there and it includes an attachment, which includes my iPhone contacts that I'm transferring over to my Android device. So I'm going to click on the email now. Okay. I went ahead and clicked on the email and then clearly there is my iPhone contacts that I'm transferring into my iPhone device. I'm going to click there now. All right. So here we are in the email and what you want to do is go ahead and just click on the iPhone contact that you're going to be importing to your Android device. All right, so once you click there, then this pop-up is going to show you that all of the contacts that you exported from your iPhone are going to be right here. If you want to go ahead and save your iPhone contacts into your Android device, click this little button down here called Save. I'm going to click there now. Okay, now my Android device is done saving my iPhone contacts and you can switch over to your phone. I'm going to go to the home screen now. All right, I'm going to click on the green phone button. All right, and now you can see my contact from my iPhone 
known are imported into my Android device. I now have 586 contacts here in my Android device from my iPhone contacts. So that's the easiest way I know how to transfer my iPhone contacts into my Android device. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. But hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.